hi guys and welcome back to today's video in this one i'm super super excited because i'm coming to you guys with another parrot review and i'm going to be talking about the brand new palette from rld young so they've just launched a new palette and of course you know me i love reviewing products i love reviewing palettes so i went ahead and bought it and we are talking about the xxl peach eyeshadow palette which looks like this of course so this is how the packaging from the outside looks like so here we are and of course when you open it here we have the inside that's how they look like so you get 12 eyeshadows in this palette six matte six shimmer and of course no mirror you can see there there's no mirror so yeah anyway and the back looks like this this is how the back looks like you can you know you can follow those instructions to create a smoky eye should you wish to so yeah and the price for this um, retails for three euro 79 cents so that's how much i bought it it's very very inexpensive so yeah without further ado we are going to play with this palette i'm going to be doing swatches i'll swatch all of these shades for you guys so you can get to see on how you know how they of course swatch on the hand so yeah let's get started as you can see there are no names in this palette so i just have to be pointing out which shade i'm using so to begin i'm going to take this shade right here and um, pop this one in the crease so let's just go ahead and take this and of course um you can see there we have some you know some falling shadows already um we're just gonna tap the access and of course go ahead and pack this one and right here that blended beautifully and there are no struggles when it comes to blending Okay, for three seventy nine, not mad at it. Not mad at it. The only thing, of course, is here in the pan. What do we have here? Yep, that's the only, the only thing. Um, moving on. What color should I take? I think I'll take this uh, darkest uh, brown here. So that's the darkest shade. We'll take this one here uh, using a different brush. Okay, that's actually not too bad. I'll pop this one here on the lid and I think I'm going to apply this using my finger oh ooh, okay all right so here is how this one looks like I actually like this one a lot this looks really really nice and it is super pigmented too hmm that is good okay okay uh, let's move on to the bottom low lashes. I am going to grab this one here that I of course applied um, in the crease and I'm going to pop this one just at the bottom here. And then I'm taking that uh, deepest brown and I'm going to apply this one um, just, at the, just right here. Just applying those two together. I'm going to take this one here and apply this one in the inner corners. Hmm, okay. This one here, I'm not getting anything from this. Um, I mean, you can see a little bit popping, but I'm not getting uh, that, you know, that like that kick, you know, um, I'm not getting that. And it's a bit, it's a bit more like powdery. Um, yeah, this one. Hmm. Okay. Uh, should we try something else? What can I pop? I'll probably try, I'll try this one here. Let's switch to this one in the inner corner, maybe. Maybe this one will get something. Uh, okay. This one also. Hmm. Yeah, this one also. I'm not really digging this one. Um, all right, you guys. Now it is time to sit down and give you my final thoughts of what I think about this palette right here from RLD Young. So I'm going to rate this palette based on the eyeshadow that I've used for this look today. I'm not going to talk about the other eyeshadows because I haven't, of course, used them on the eyes, even though I swatched them on the hand. 
but sometimes hand swatches aren't exactly the same as on how the shadows will look like on the eyes of course so uh, to begin with i took this uh, brown shade right here apply that in the crease uh, this applied beautifully no issues no patchiness at all beautifully and it was very very easy straight up and it was good to go and uh, the only thing of course we had kickback we had fallout but you know it is what it is uh a next shade i've used is this dark brown right here and i popped this one on the outer v right here that also blended beautifully i had no issue that oh it's they are very very easy shadows to work with beautiful uh and again we had some kickback there just like the other one but otherwise they blended beautifully and you know they're very easy you know this look i created so so simple uh the only shade that did not work for me are these two here uh this one here and of course this one here i applied this one in my inner corner and i did not like how they look because i did not get like a wow coming from them they did not pop probably if i use like a setting spray that could have helped but i just applied them straight so those one it's not really for me uh, i will try again in the future uh, with a setting spray and see how they work so yeah those are the only shades that i've used in this palette and i think um Overall, it's not a bad palette. It's it's okay, you know, uh, for everyday use. I would have loved to see like a deeper brown shade in this palette um, other than this because that's how deep it goes. So if you want to create like a deeper extra smoke eye, I think uh, you'll find it a little bit difficult to achieve that using this color right here as it is the darkest brown you get in this one. So it could have been nice to have like a black um, eyeshadow here or even like a extra extra deeper 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 brown shade so as you can see here that's how deep it goes i even layered it a couple times but that's how deep it goes so yeah could have been nice to have a black shade in here or even like you know something darker but other than that it is a cute palette not too bad uh for three euro 79 i think it's not too bad even though there's no mirror here but you know it's, it's affordable so yeah anyway uh that's it for this video you guys i hope you enjoyed it if you did don't forget to give it a huge massive thumbs up subscribe join the family i would love to have you here thank you so much for watching this one take care and i will see you guys in my next one bye for now